Tony, take me through early in the game as Florida International started to drive down the field. You had a big pass break up in the end zone. Coach Wilson referred to it as a, almost a four-point play, stopping with a field goal. Take me through that play, what you saw, and, and how big you thought it was for the defense. I think that was a huge turning point in the game for our defense. You know, I've, I think that's the difference between last year and this year, is guys stepping up and making plays when we need it. And that was just an effort play and me not you know, wanting to give up a touchdown. So I did that for my teammates. Coach Allen obviously coming in and through the, the summer, the, the off season, a lot of excitement going into the first game of what the new defense is going to look like, a brand new year. But now that you've had that first game in the books and obviously some success on the defensive side of the ball as well, how do you build off of that going through this season? Uh, we have a lot to build on, a lot of improvements. You know, We did have success, but we also made a lot of mistakes. And we looked at that, and we're correcting those mistakes every day. So I think it's important to keep our mentality and keep that edge and come out every day with the focus that we need to become the defense that we know we can be. There were plenty of other strong individual performances in your defensive backfield, aside from yourself, Richard Fant, obviously, with the, with the interception. A lot of talk about uh, Ashawn Riggins and what he was able to do. How do you grade, I guess, what your other defensive backs were able to do around you in game one? Uh, the DBs, you know, leading up to this season, we all got together and we just decided that, you know, this defense would go as we go. So we take that personal. Everything that happens on the field, we believe that we have to be a part in making a big impact. So I think this year our focus is every guy doing their job, being locked in and being focused so we can um, make great plays. Ball State coming here this weekend for the home opener. Like yourself, they are 1-0 with a, with a road victory down in Georgia. What have you seen preparing for them? What kind of challenges will they present to you? Uh, Ball State will be a very good challenge. They're a very good team. They have great players. Um, you know, they have kind of a pro-style offense. They do a lot of great things on offense. So I think it's key that guys come in every day with the focus that we need to watch film and prepare, you know, like it's the biggest game of our lives. Thanks, Tony. Yeah, thank you.